Hello there. Uh, I'm probably not gonna sleep for a couple days after this, but yes, I am in a good mood. Arsenal just beat Leeds. Wow, my boys, my boys, we're in the quarterfinals of the Carabao Cup, but you guys don't care about that. You're here to see my reaction to Halloween 2018, because this is a shout out to my friend Chris, who told me to watch it because he invited me to a drive-in of Halloween Kills tomorrow, and I'm still iffy as to whether I want to go. I'll see how I go with this one, but yes, I have seen the first two Halloweens, the... OG 1978 and Halloween 2 and I know this is a sequel to those two as it retcons all the other films that pass those two but I haven't seen the rest after those two so I guess it's okay to watch this and I know this film was really divisive but I've never seen it before I've only seen the trailer when it came out years ago or whenever but yeah I'm interested to see how this film goes I'm probably not gonna sleep for a while because I don't take horror too well but yes this is Halloween Kills ladies and gentlemen um, we are getting on oh no, a Hall Halloween Kills Halloween 2018, <laughs> but yes, I'm very excited to see this, um, but I'm very scared as well, because I don't take horror too well. My friend Chris, he told me to watch The Conjuring before this, and I'm just like, yo, my man, I'm getting scared from the Scream TV series on Netflix. I, 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 like, I literally have trouble sleeping from that. Like, slashes get me scared, and like, imagine watching The Conjuring. I wouldn't sleep for a month. This is probably going to take me out for a few days. <laughs> but yeah, we'll see. I'm already having trouble sleeping as it is from Scream, but... Uh... Just a quick FYI, I really enjoyed the first Halloween. I really liked it. I thought the second one was okay, but much more of the same. And I think on a technical level was far inferior to the first one i thought the first one was really great but this one i've heard mixed stuff on in terms of like oh it's a shop shot remake of the first oh but i've heard good things as well from some people so i'm intri intrigued to see it and let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of that and what what your problems are with it for instance or what you like about it do not cross the line under any circumstances oh okay they're gonna cross the line under every circumstance <laughs> michael that it crossed. That counts. VAR. Guessing Michael has some sort of like symbiotic feel connection the mask. with the mask. Yeah. Be alone. Be alone. Bro, the one person you do not want to interrogate or antagonize. Sorry, not interrogate. Both actually with his mask. Is the psychotic killer standing right in front of you? You are basically signing off your death warrant right there. <laughs> Say something. Ooh, okay. Is there a reason why everyone else was going like completely absurd? Hey, I like that homage to the first film at the beginning and the opening credits. I like it. I like it. <laughs> Damn, Laurie Strode has the prisoner of Azkaban locked down Hello. on her house. <laughs> you know when Dumbledore shut down <laughs> Hogwarts? Really? She Come got in. all those security systems. Sit down and talk. Two failed marriages, rocky relationship with your daughter and granddaughter. Michael Myers murdered five people. And he's Wait. a human being. I could swear he murdered more across the first two films. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. This is only a sequel to the... F oh, this is like a continuation and a follow-up of the first film. It doesn't even take into consideration the second film. Okay, my bad, my bad. I take I take away what I said in the intro about being a sequel to the first two films. It's just the first. It's just the first. My bad, my bad. You need to understand. What a waste of like 10 films after. <laughs> all, those, all those directors of like the first, the next installments, I'm like, what the heck, bro? We're <laughs> transferring him. Tomorrow. Why don't you sit down with him and say all the things you must be longing to say? Oh, that'd be a lot of swear Come words, man. <laughs> that'd that be a lot of insults. Please. Time's up. Pretty much all she talks about is she finds her life. She's been traumatized ever since. Wasn't it her brother who, like, cold-blooded murdered all those teenagers? No. 
that's just a bit that some people made up to feel better, I think. I mean, that is scary to have a bunch of your friends get that, We throw away that. that. We throw it. It never happens. Isn't, though, because all things considered, there's a lot worse stuff that's happening today. I understand that someone who has nothing left in this world may still know bliss. His message is totally hopeless. Oh! Woo! <laughs> Life can find its meaning, oh. and conversely, so can one person. I... Correct me if I'm wrong. I have, a, I have a really bad memory. I've only seen the first one once. Wasn't there like a shot like that with Michael Myers' butt in the opposite? I think, I think. But like, this time Laurie's in that position. Use it for whatever your heart desires. I'll save it for college then. Fuck college. Go somewhere. <laughs> Could you imagine? Yeah. All this preparation, it was for nothing. I mean, it took priority over your family. Oh, oh he's coming. He's coming. The no way worries. I raised your mother means that she hates me. Damn, damn. All right, all right, Laurie. You took him to John Wick. We get it. We get it. We get it. We get it. I like how Jamie Lee Curtis, like in this film, is like in freaking badass mode. Like she went full Sarah Connor. <laughs> She's also in like don't give a crap mode when she speaks. There's nothing to be gained from keeping evil alive. That's nice how they brought Dr. Loomis back. Like in unconscious. Oh, Laurie's overseeing his transfer as well. She's like, I gotta make sure. <laughs> Out some pretty interesting things. She said she was gonna come. She came to my office. We had a nice talk. Did you? <laughs> the the mom is capping so hard here. <laughs> His daughter's like, bro, I just spoke to her earlier today. <laughs> nice. Do you know where she is? Hey, it Made ran it. late. I'm sorry. Speak of the boogeyman. She has arrived. Hi, Hi. I'm uh, I'm the grandmother. <laughs> I'm Cameron Ewan. And we're here celebrating our daughter. Yes, I know. <laughs> I learned how to shoot a gun when I was eight. <laughs> I learned how to fight. <laughs> I had nightmares about the basement. Laurie gave her the Khabib treatment, bro. Fighting bears Social at like four years old. Was <laughs> years old and took me away. Dad, look out! Oh, what the fudge happened? What the hell happened to you? <laughs> That's what I just said. Shit. Dad, look. Lumpy, you stay here. I really like the aesthetic and the lighting here. It's like sort of the fog and mist, and you can see like the uh, patients in the background and the shadows. <gasps> oh, my word. Wait here. I'll go get my dad. No. Run! Bro, the cops should just radio in for backup if he can talk. Use your mic, my friend. Don't shoot! <laughs> oh no. I guess that was like, um, that was like just reflex. Oh! Don't kill the kid, bro! He's just a kid! Oh, he broke his neck. Oh, damn. My man's neck is like... Show your hands! I've been shot. Woman, just run. Oh. Run. Your Myers loose with a bunch of nut bags. And haven't fell on Halloween night. We're gonna have a fucking circus on our hands. <laughs> We're gonna have more than a but circus, bro. You're gonna have a massacre. What are we gonna do? I don't know why they decide to transfer him on the Halloween Eve, bro. It's just like if you picked November first or like October twentieth or something, like that, maybe a different day. 
40 years to the day, the doctor should have taken into account the anniversary. <laughs> like, we, we don't want to transfer him the Halloween, but now nah, we'll transfer him on the eve of Halloween, just so, yeah. You know, he's released at that time. <laughs> I'm liking how they're hiding Michael's face at the moment with like sort of that one there when he pulled up with just like wide shots and he's like not focused in like similar to that there or like you would just see his eye a little bit in a close-up from behind as he turns they do a clever job at it not bad How does Michael Myers know where to find him? Like at this exact gas station? Unless he has some like connection I said to the mask and he just knows where to oh, find the mask. Woo! My man! I'm just trying to see like... Oh, he just murdered everyone in there. Like he didn't care. He just doesn't care, he's just gonna go on a rampage now. Call the cops. That's what I do. Straight away. <laughs> oh! We got a couple of shots in. Oh! Yo, Aaron, Aaron getting whacked, bro. Oh. Woo! It's like 10 concussions, bro. Hmm. I'm guessing no one arrived. No one else arrived to the service station just to like see that this murders or call the police and they just enabled him to get his mask and now he's jetting which is a freaky mask by the way especially police like have not determined a cause of this accident what the heck <laughs> even laurie has got a secret armory bro <laughs> yeah look at this it's a hospital gown. State issue. You're on the phone to Smith's role to find the match. You know I was there that night. Oh, so he's the OG police there. officer from the first film. I didn't realize that. We Sorry, my bad. It's a hunter's thing down. I love how he calls it a thing as well. Like, he knows what's up. <laughs> he knows what they went through that night. And he's the only one that can probably, like, at the moment, understand what Laurie is like. Trying to achieve. We're supposed to be here later this night. Take that one over on the front street. Sorry, but sorry. You know what? It's not quite as scary as the one that got me in my first Halloween reaction. I'll try and put the clip in right now. <laughs> Bro, they hit you when you least expect it, man. Oh my gosh. And look at the framing. Not showing his face. <laughs> Following the kid as well. Oh my gosh. Like, you, it's hitting you when you... Oh, shit. <laughs> but yeah, that, that got me so hard of the kid running from the school. But that was a nice little homage. <laughs> the OG hammer, bro. That's the one from 40 years ago as well. Bro, it's like the same recreation of the scene for the first of the old woman making dinner. Except I think in that, I think in the first... Bro, why? Bro! Bro! <laughs> Except I think in the first film, it was the POV of Michael Myers entering the house. But like, same outcome. Oh no, I can't remember if he killed the woman.
Oh, he didn't kill the baby. At least he has some sort of, you know, moral code, I guess. If you're under 10 years old, I won't harm you. But the other kid was 11 who died in the truck, so that's why. Nice. I like some of the camera work so far. It's like nice long takes. The camera holds and it's all done in one shot. But is he targeting specific people? Or is he just going for anyone? That was a trick, bro. You guys are seriously beautiful. You seriously beautiful. Give me a smile. Give me a big smile. Son, Dave's already on his way. And he's going to bring the, uh, you know, the Alakazam, if you know what I mean. And Julian's parents are going to be back in Dolce for life. Okay, well, it is a school night, so we're not going to... That kid's like, yo. Kazam too much. Oh, come on. It's a school night. Don't be a needy bitch. Get over here. Okay, I'll see you soon. We'll come over as soon as it's over. You know, like a mag magic trick, like Abracadabra. I, I know you're talking about smoking weed. Don't lie to me. That's against the rules. I'm telling my mom. Well, I'm going to tell your mom about your browser history. You better not. Oh. You can get me in trouble, I can get you in trouble. I'm... You used to be my favorite, but now you're like my 10th favorite boy that I nanny. And I babysit some fucking loser kids. <laughs> I thought I was just swearing in front of me. She'd be reading me a story. I wouldn't be up clipping my nasty-ass toenails. Nice. Yo, Vicky gonna die. By the way, you're actually my favorite kid I babysit for. I like you too. Vicky gonna die, bro. <laughs> Babysitters don't end well. Doesn't end well for them. Oh, teenage drama. Oh, I couldn't care any less. Here, you know what? No. Your fucking precious phone? Why? <laughs> what the fuck? You're gonna get that. Or you want me to get it? Oh! Sorry. Why? ring the doorbell. Like, oh, Ooh. kid. It's okay. Check it out. Fresh from my patch. Oh my god! You guys are hearts. Oh yeah. Come here. Remember Randy's rules and scream, bro? Don't have sex. If you have sex, you're gonna die. Oh, fuck me. I saw someone in the hallway standing outside my door. Oh, what's up, buddy? There was a fucked up face watching me from the dark. Ghosts and goblins, little buddy. Shut up, Dave. I heard him weeping. <laughs> Okay, alright, come on, I got you. Let's check it out. Sit Dave first! <laughs> no, it's fine. No, 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 no
Yes. Listen to the kid, Dave. Just run. So far, it's not too bad, like a mid-movie review, but obviously we had some of like shot for shot or like scene for scene remakes from the first film. Some of it was technically done really well, like long takes as well, which is great. But so far, there's been not much tension or like um, suspense in any scene. It's just Michael Myers popping up doing the kills and it's just like, okay, whatever. He just killed him in a brutal way, which is what you'd expect so far. Damn. Bro, Michael must... Is that Michael or Vicky? <laughs> That's nice. I like that. <laughs> Look who's up. Where is he? This guy, this guy's the B Tech Loomis, isn't he? He's just like, I'll arrive at the crime scene and be like, gotta give you the info. I lost control after Michael overtook the first guard and the driver. He strolled, meet Dr. Sertain. I'm Michael's doctor, Andrew Sertain. <laughs> she even says it. <laughs> I read everything about you and Michael. Allison, please, they like they were feeding me guacamole in all these sexy ways. Not my na 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 na. Hey, hey, hey. goodbye. Happy Halloween, Miss Jellrod. I'm. I'm just, I don't know, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to trespass on your yard and shit, man. I was just trying to take a shortcut with a really pretty girl, and I just, I just really like her, man. And I thought that she liked me, too, and I just, I just, have you ever really liked a girl and you just couldn't have her? <laughs> yeah, he's just stuff, bro. He I'm, killed I'm sorry, man. Th I'll just, I'll piece out of your hair, man. Th thank, thank you for, for just. There's more comic relief in this film than I expected. Like, I've never seen someone like, especially the, like besides the kid, have like a one-on-one -on -one hey, heart-to-heart uh, Michael Myers. Where'd like you go, that. man? You're acting, dude. You're acting like really sketchy right now. I'm, I'm, I'm leaving, right? I don't. Oh, Mike, that is clever with the lights. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, it's gonna jump scare right in front of you. <laughs> yep. Oh my God. Bro, why do you use the other fence? Run somewhere else, bro. Step away from the suspect. Step away. Yeah. What the heck? What's the doctor doing? Fuck. Michael's just gonna kill you, bro. That was such a stupid twist. So, There's this is what it feels like. 
Uh, oh, he just wants to know what it feels like to kill someone. Wow. <laughs> What's the doctor doing, bro? I would suspect the notion of being a predator or the fear of becoming prey <laughs> keeps both of them alive. I love how he's just chilling there in the back with the girl in the car. Oh, and he runs over the cop. What a prick. What? What is that? Let me go, and I will tell you what he said. You must tell me. I must know. You must tell Let me. me go, and I'll tell you what he said. Just stop the car, and I'll tell you what he said. <laughs> this guy has a massive hard-on for Michael Myers. He's like, yo. Who's that? That's weird, right? Oh. <laughs> Mom. What was the word? Fuck. Michael. <laughs> Video burnout. Fuck. How did the doctor think it was going to end? Fuck. Please respond. Say something. <laughs> Say hello to my foot. The dad's gonna die. <laughs> oh! Did he like... Like carve his head like a pumpkin. Oh, there goes your husband, my friend. <laughs> oh, 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 damn. Pretty dumb of Lori to stand right there on the door next to the glass. So now it's just going to be, I'm guessing, like a final confrontation in this house, like a standoff. She knows his tricks, bro. She knows his candy spots. Damn, she got all the rooms on lockdown. This is home alone with Michael Myers. She got all the traps ready. I love how Laurie's the one hunting down Michael Myers now when it should be the like when it like in the first one was like completely the opposite. She was running away from him. Oh my word. <gasps> Poor Ray Ray. I like the tension here, it's good. Good stuff. Because the only sense of light is her flashlight. <laughs> and it's the same for the audience as well, so you're just constantly like, what the heck, where is he gonna pop up? Oh! Bro, she beat him! Pretty ruthless. Surely Michael has some sort of respect for Laurie now. He's like, yo. <laughs> I like that, I like that. <laughs> Similar to the first film where Laurie looks over the back and he sees Michael. <laughs> Laurie disappears now. <laughs> it's funny because like if the if the girl didn't yell, Michael would have just seen Laurie just strolling away. <laughs> but because she yelled and he looked away, it, it had that effect. So it was like perfect timing. It's just like, like what the heck?
<laughs> he knows, bro. He knows. <laughs> she had that ruthlessness in her the whole time. Happy Halloween, Michael. Oh. Oh. Everything's up. Oh, he just did the Undertaker. Oh, God Almighty. Like grandmother, like mother. <laughs> hey, yo, what the hell? Oh, she gon' she gon' blaze the place. Okay, it's not a cage, baby. It's a trap. What if Michael just caught the flare and he's like, you know? <laughs> Damn. Bro, I'd get out of the house if I were them. Why are they just sitting there watching? Hey, yo, where's Michael? No, did Michael die? It's not like there's another one coming out. Oh, they just ended up there. Okay. I remember this coming out at the theater. That's why when I worked there. And I was able to see the end credits. And apparently you can hear his breathing at the end. I just want to confirm if this is true. Yeah, yeah, you can, you can. You can. Okay. But like, I just want to confirm that because I knew there was... <laughs> like, you still know that there's another movie coming up. I just wanted to see if, uh, if I remembered that. So, um... I don't know what to think. Like, it was... It, was, it wasn't as scary as I thought it would be. Um, there was some great tense moments towards the end. Like, the final confrontation where it was like a Home Alone... Um, Laurie versus Michael Myers. I think that was the best bit of the film. Other than that, like... Although some of the kills were brutal, there were just like so many expendable characters just getting killed by Michael Myers, like similar to the first film. I still think the first film did it much better. I think um, technically there were some bits in this film as well, like I mentioned with some of the long takes and the camera holding, that was great as well. Um, however, I still think the first film did it better. Um, I just think this film is okay. It's still good, but I just think the first film did so much better um, from like a technical standpoint and as well just... Um, creatively using Michael Myers more. Um, I think this film, like, there was some face in comedy. I didn't expect that, especially from the little kid um, that was just, like, talking about weed and just, like, in the situations when Michael came in, the way he was yelling and just jetting out of the place. But, yeah, um, I thought Jamie Lee Curtis was great as Laurie Strode. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed her in this film. But other than that, some of the teenage stuff, eh. I think you could have shaved off a lot of that and then focused on michael myers more and used a bit uh, like focus on creating more tension in some of the sequences rather than him just running around killing people i know that's what some people want but let me know what you guys think of this film in the comment section down below i know there's a lot of people that love it there's a lot of people that dislike it and some are mixed i think i fall a bit in the middle um i thought it was good and entertaining um but didn't get much suspense and horror besides like a little bit towards the end of the third act yeah some of the kills were um kind of brutal but other than that, it was just, yeah, it was okay. It was okay. And in terms of a ranking, guys, I'm going to give Halloween 2018 the rank of Padawan. Yes, hopefully you guys enjoyed this movie reaction today. If you've enjoyed, feel free to like, share, subscribe. As always, take care, God bless, and peace.